Our fighters are ready to get down to it, so let's start the match and see what these warriors are capable of. I'm not gonna lose. Round one. Fight. Here we go. What are these fighters going to do? Blocks the jump in. Opts for the throw. Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Player one is maintaining the corner position for some juicy damage. Takes a trip. His life lead is opening up, but that could still be overcome with smart drive use. In a dire situation, they can't afford any mistakes. Hey ho! Player one picks up the always important first round. They'll want to keep the ball rolling. Round two. Fight. Looks like they want to establish a rhythm with their ground game and fireball. Uses the drive rush here to steal their turn. Player two has a slight life lead that they may sit on. Going in, player one rushes that off and keeps going. Player two can't use any drive moves without burning out. Full SA meters on deck for both sides. This could be over soon. Player one holding on to that corner advantage. Ah, uh, burnout activate. Yo, kicking off their facial features with the Hayoku set. Life lead is there, but still anyone's game. The fighters return to the middle of the stage. Attempts to break the stalemate with the fireball. Break through with the throw. We're going into the final round tied up. Which fighter has it in them to grind out the win? Final round. Fight. Dash! Jumps in. This is gonna hurt! Here we go. Uh-oh. This could really hit the scale. Where's the super? Time for dessert! Player two sets up with the jump in! Player one walls flat into the drive frame! Yes, sir! More damage, please! Over in a flash! Round one. Fight. The fight's now underway. This is Vicious with the play-by-play. -play. Tries to bait him with the projectile. Plenty of time left. How's the match gonna play out? Okay, we're in the early stages of the round. Knockdown. Player two creates a good hold your breath. Picture perfect punish counter. A drive impact. Hmm, taking stop. Player one doesn't have a lot of drive gauge to play with. Not a good thing. What's their game plan here at this critical stage? We are near the end of the round. Can either fighter pull a rabbit out of their Ah, burnout activates! Takes a trip. Player one chases him down. K.O. Player two on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. Round two. Fight. Ooh, it looks like they're waiting to see what the opponent wants to do first. Hits them with a vagabond edge. Uses the drive rush here to steal their turn. Looks like they want to put a new spin on things with that fireball. You know their fireball game is solid because they're only throwing it when their opponent can't jump them. Player two can build off this lead. There's been some back and forth, but no one has dominated the fight. Both fighters have a full super meter on deck. The winner will be the one who manages it best. Player two will look to apply pressure here. What'll happen here? This, this is reaching some big damage. Oh, this is a complete shutdown. They can't escape. Keeps them out. Manages to block the jump. Sees the overhead coming. Are we going to see a comeback? K.O. Round one. Fight. The fight's now underway. This is Vicious with the play-by-play. Tries to bait him with the projectile. Okay, we're in the early stages of the round. What's the play here? Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Buys some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. Hold your breath. Punishes that ill-timed attack with a drive impact. Very bad choice there. Trips him up. This is a real back and forth match for scene. They definitely know what the other is capable of. Decides to spend them as a little super juice into this combo for more damage. 
Yo, kicking off their facial features with a Hayoku set. Player one creates a good corner opportunity. Can't tech the throw? What'll happen here? Smart use of the invincibility on who finishes it with anti air. Player two on the board first with the win. They'll want to keep the pressure on. Round two. Fight. Check with a medium kick. Who's going to start things off? Nice tech. That tech's what you get when both sides go in on the throw. Player one is working with a better game. What can they do with it? What separates the good from the great in this game is smart game management. Going by Normio Theorem with a potion trap. Both fighters planning something? Player one will look to apply pressure here. Ever can with the lightning kicks. Their spacing is so on point right now. But who's gonna blink first? Sets up with the jump in. And they create an opportunity for themselves. Ah, burnout activates. Throw tech. Fades out the low kick. Player one is in a very good, tries to act quickly, but with the attack. Oh, and with a rush. Flatline zone. We're going into the final round tied up. Which fighter has it in them to grind out the win? Fight round. Fight. Medium kick. Close range for solid and by air. Read the jump in perfectly. They just said, get that jump in out of here. Player two with the rhythm owning that space. Both are ready to pull the trigger on their super. Perfect execution with the anti air. Connects with the throw. Player one, a huge chance after that wall splash. Jagabon forever elevator. Overhead. Leave them from above with the potion beat. Looks up some hot and spicy damage with the potion beat. Oh, putting the cherry on top. Hits them with a potion scramble. 9 to 5 work damage incoming. Oh, they switch sides. Oh, are you serious? That comeback was unreal. We just saw the spiders play out of their goddamn mind there.